7.45, April 7th. Just leaving the shelter, it rained all night. It's foggy because the clouds are low. Uh, it's dripping off the trees, I don't think it's raining. First one out this morning is me. I would have been out earlier, but uh, people were still sleeping in the shelter, so. Um, at uh, 18 miles into Damascus, trying to crush that today, we'll see what happens. All right, uh, have a good day. You know what we get to do today? We get to have, uh, hike the Appalachian Trail, that's right. All right, it's raining foggy, so I don't have the uh, views. Or anything special to show you, so like we're just going white blaze to white blaze here. Right, foggy <coughs> rain stripping off the trees. I do have my raincoat on today, <coughs> so I'm sweating on the inside too. <coughs> it's wet by choice, I guess. Warm and wet, that's always a good one. All right, we're just dropping off this mountain on this nasty down here full of rocks and acorns and roots. <sighs> you get good days on the trail and you get bad days. Yesterday was gorgeous, it started out cold, but got really nice. Thunderstorms overnight, heavy. I mean, Lightning thunder at the same time, right next to the shelves on top of the mountain. Crazy stuff. Doing an 18 into Damascus today. Going white blazed to white blaze. Okay, that's Pathfinder. She stayed at the shelter with me last night. She's got a vlog too, YouTube vlog. So, it, uh, Rain right overnight, the cold front's going through, temperature's dropping, it's pretty foggy. Uh, not supposed to get much more than 57 today, but we'll be in town, I hope, and get some place to warm up and dry out. That's the plan. She's faster than I am, so she's gonna be hitting the road here in a second. Much faster. There's a group coming behind us too, so. <sighs> Take a little break, and get back on trail here real soon. See ya. Okay, it looks like the woodpecker's been pretty busy on that tree. A lot of work being done. It's all scattered way over here. It might be from the wind, but man, those things can pound, can't they? All right. All right, 9.30, first view of the day. This is Cloud Field Valley. I don't know how well you can see it. Uh, everything's warmer down there. That's why there's clouds colder up here. I think I'm gonna be climbing that later in a little now, probably. <sighs> Stopped raining, cleared off. Except for down there in the valley where it's cloudy. I see a little sunshine over there actually. That's hard to believe. Right over there is some sunshine. So it turns out to be an alright day eventually. Let's hope so. It's cold and wet right now. Right, we got some kind of rock wall here. And you know you're in Tennessee and the war was fought here, civil war, so I don't know if that's so if that was used during the civil war or if it's just somebody clearing their property, farming up here. This is a gap, so maybe they did have yeah, a little skirmish or a battle here, but <clears throat> more than likely it's just farming. But pretty cool rock wall here, northern Tennessee, northeastern Tennessee, just a few miles from Virginia. And just like that. It ends. I got Queen's Knob Shelter. Uh, probably the worst shelter on the trail, I would think. Uh, it doesn't look like it's water safe, doesn't look like it's wind safe, doesn't look like it's safe. We're ready to fall over, actually. Uh, they probably can numb the soon, I would think, and uh, rebuild a new one here or something. This is another one a couple miles up over a hill which I'll be going to shortly. There's no water here, there's nothing. So I'm gonna uh, drink a little water, eat a little lunch and be out of here. So Queen Snob Shelter, unbelievable. Okay, I would think we're about 10 miles from the Damascus, getting closer to the border. Also getting close to the 
100 mile mark for me this year. I start at 365, we're gonna cross 465 here today and the border of Tennessee and North Carolina in just a little bit. So I wanted to show you where we're at and what we're doing. AT baby. I believe we're looking into southwestern Virginia, but it could be wrong. But some valley there between the two ridges, lots of farming going on up here. That's Pathfinder just went by me again. We've been hopping over each other all day. Absolutely gorgeous all down. It's a little windy here as you can hear, but um, not too bad. Sun shining, that's always good. Hi, my name is Renee Messina. I'm a trail maintainer with the Tennessee Eastman Hiking Club. Um, I'm out here with a group today. We have about 12 people, a um, couple of people with chainsaws up there, a couple of people digging in trail down there, and I'm painting blazes. So anyway, happy trails. All right, so if you get lost, it's her fault. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got a picture of her now. All right, here's a couple of maintenance guys. Pull up those drawers, no cracks. Tennessee, Eastern Tennessee or whatever it is. Yeah, we're from we're from T E H C C. I'm Joe. This is Van. Cool. How you doing? Thank I'm I'm How train you wreck. You're, hi train wreck. <laughs> we're both so we're in good you're in good company right now, yeah, train wreck, because we're right. both we're both ex train wrecks, aren't yeah. we? Yes. <laughs> There's life beyond train wreck? Perfect. There is. Yeah, yeah we're man. Gonna live, we're gonna live. You're in there. Well, thanks for all your service on the trail. Appreciate Absolutely. it. Man. Absolutely. Our I had a long conversation with Renee about how shitty the trail is. Just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. No, well, see, what we think is crap. You know, so, yeah, anyway. <laughs> trail Maintainers on Facebook if you want to follow us. Oh, okay. Got for it. Those yeah. people trail following, Maintainers on Facebook. Good, yeah, cool. for yeah. those people following you. Yeah. Yeah. All right. As I approach this next little knob, that's the three, uh, excuse me, 465 mark. So today, uh, 11 days of hiking, I hiked 100 miles. I took two zeros, so I really only hiked nine days. And then nine into 100 is 10 miles plus one more. So I uh, love averaging about 11 miles a day. And we're getting close. And then we're gonna go across the border today too, sometime on this descent, I think, so. Thanks to all who support me. 100 miles in nine days. Not bad for getting started. Legs are still toast. We're gonna get there, we're gonna get in shape and we're gonna get going, so. Thanks you very much. All right, so we went by those um, trail workers, Appalachian Trail maintenance people. Uh, they are not paid. They do that volunteer work uh, when they can. Most of them are retired, semi-retired, or just really interested in the trail and want to give back. So they were doing some chainsawing and they were doing some trail maintenance. And then I talked to the supervisor, Renee. So another great day on the trail to see that. So Okay, I don't know if you can read that or not. This is Tennessee, Virginia state line. I am now out of Virgi Tennessee and into Virginia, three and a half miles to Damascus. We are entering the Mount Rogers NRA Jefferson National Forest. Tennessee, Virginia state line, Damascus three and a half. Tennessee Valley to Spivey Gap maintained by TEHCC, Tennessee to Virginia. <coughs> That's those people I saw. All right, so I made it to Damascus, famous trail town. Uh, I got a lot of work to do, a lot of things to do, so pretty cool. Uh, yeah.